There's this great story in a book or an essay by Jim Koch, who's a founder of a, the Boston Beer Company, I think. He goes, when he initially started his company, um, he, one of his financial backers was an uncle, I think, at Goldman Sachs, who's a partner at Goldman Sachs. And so one day, is, in the early days of the company, uncle calls him up and says, hey, Jim, you know, how's it going? How's business? Hey, it's good. You know, I've got my first case, you know, all ready to go and, you know, yada, yada, yada. We're producing, you know, things are great. He goes, okay, what'd you do today? And he goes, oh, well, uh, i uh, shopping for computers. He goes, why are you shopping for computers? He goes, well, I figure, you know, I'm going to need a computer to track sales and, you know, inventory and accounts receivable, all that kind of stuff. And he goes, oh, yeah, sales. How's that going? <laughs> and he goes, well, uh, I don't have any yet. And his uncle goes, well, so you're shopping for a computer to track sales, but you don't have any sales yet. And he goes, well, yeah. And he goes, Jim, first things first, more companies have gone out of business because of a lack of sales than a lack of computers. And um, that was the kick in the rear that Jim needed to put first things first and actually go out and start selling. Now, unfortunately, I see this all the time in my work. Um, people will do anything possible, everything possible to avoid actually selling something, actually having a sales conversation, actually putting a freaking offer in front of somebody. They'll, they'll do everything else. They'll work on their website. They will write a book. <laughs> they will record a podcast. Um, they will refine their offer. Um, they'll spend more time than they need to with existing clients. Um, they'll take a walk. Like they will do anything but actually make a sale. And that's what sinks them in the end because sales is the lifeblood of a business. Sales means cash. Cash is what makes your business breathe. It's the oxygen that your business needs to survive. Without oxygen, your business will die. And sales creates that oxygen, that cash. So friendly reminder to you, um, courtesy of Jim Koch, if you're not selling, you're not doing the most important thing in your business. You're not doing the thing that will keep your business alive. And everything else, second to selling, should be a secondary priority because you won't have the opportunity to continue doing everything else in your business if you don't sell.